Hi everybody, I'm Asha Kelly. Welcome to the Gundam Martial Art Lesson. In this lesson today, we're gonna practice some fun martial art moves. Now before we get started, make sure you guys like this video and subscribe, so that way you don't miss out on new videos. Also, make sure you stick to the end of the video because I'll be talking about our brand new comic books that we're gonna be making. Okay, so stick to the end if you want to hear more about that. Let's get started. Can yet? All right, we'll start with jumping jacks. Repeat after me. And let's say, Hana, do it. Set, net, toss it. Good job, awesome. Start rotating arms, ready, Hana. Do it. Set, net, toss it. Good job, going the other way, Hana. Do it. Set, net, toss it. Good, awesome. We're gonna work with some punches, okay? So we're gonna go jab crosses just like this. Ready, Hana. Do it. Set, net, toss it. Good, now this time do some uppercuts. Ready, Hana. Do it. Set, net, toss it. Good, some knees this time, right and left. Ready, Hana. Do it. Set, net, toss it. Good, one last one, reaching for your toes. Just hang like this. Ready, Hana. Do it. Set, net, Awesome, good job, and come back up. All right, shake your hands, shake out your legs. Chariet, Kenya. Awesome, all right, when I say fighting stance, one foot back, what bends up. Ready, fighting stance. Awesome, good, all right, start bouncing your feet like this. All right, here's what we're gonna do. When I say Hana, we're going to jump up, and as we jump up, we're gonna pick up both knees like that. Okay, we're doing a jumping switch, ready? And let's say Hana. Good job, ready, do it. Good job, set. Good, net. Good, pass it. Awesome, one more and yes it. Good job, okay, now this time, we're gonna jump and as we jump, we're gonna throw a front kick. When you do a front kick, you're gonna point your toe and you're gonna kick straight at the middle. So we're gonna do jumping front kicks. We'll do our right leg first, ready? And let's say, Hana. Good job, ready? Now other leg now, do it. Good, good job, ready? And set. Good, good job, net. Good, one more, pass it. Awesome, good job you guys, have fun. Very good work, okay, so we just did jumping front kick. Now this time, we're going to be jumping, but we're gonna do a scissor front kick, okay? So when you do a scissor front kick, you pick up this knee first, and then you kick with the leg on the ground. So here, scissor, front kick, just like that. Let's do four of those together, ready? Pick up this knee, and kick. Awesome, good, that's one, ready? Pick up this knee, kick. Two, good job, good job. Pick up this knee, three. Good, good job, ready, one more. Pick up this knee, and four. Awesome, good job, you guys have five. Very, very good work. All right, you guys are ready to play a game? Ah, I don't believe you. So yes, sir? Awesome, awesome, all right, we're gonna play a game. So tell yet? can you? Awesome, awesome, all right, when I say fighting stance, one foot back, both ends up, ready, fighting stance. Awesome, good, all right, we're gonna turn facing this way now. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna be going on top of the Gundam robot. Now, when we go to the top of the Gundam robot, we're gonna be operating the ship. Now, when we're operating the ship, every punch that we throw, the Gundam is also gonna be punching the enemy robots too, okay? So ready, let's go ahead and go onto the ship. Okay, all right, we're inside the mobile Gundam suit, okay? So whenever your hands up just like this, good. Now, whatever punches we do, the robot's also gonna do with us, okay? So let's defeat the other robots together, ready? Let's do this combination. Let's go, I'm gonna say jab, cross, front kick, scissor front kick. Awesome, good, again, jab, cross, front kick, scissor front kick. Awesome, good job you guys, ready two more times, ready? Jab, cross, front kick, scissor front kick. Awesome, good, good, one more, ready? Go jab, cross, Front kick, scissor front kick. Awesome, good job you guys, high five. Very, very good work, awesome. Oh, uh-oh, you guys hear a sound? Oh no, there's a bunch of robots. There's like five of them this time. Okay, they're gonna be coming to attack us. Now here's what you gotta do, while we're inside the suit, we're gonna be jumping up, and as we jump up, we're going to turn and turn to the other side, okay? Ready, jump. Good, okay, now here's what you're gonna do. Once we're here, we're gonna do two punches. We're gonna go jab, cross, and then we're gonna jump and spin, and do a jab, cross on that side, okay? We're gonna do this 10 times. 
to get rid of all the robots coming from us on both sides. You guys handle that? Awesome, good. All right, hands up buddy stance. All right, here's the first one, ready, go. Jab, cross, jump and spin, good. Here's number two, go. Good, number three, go. Good, try to keep up with me. Number four, go. Good, number five, go. Good, awesome. All right, now for the last five, here's what I guess to do. As fast as you can. I want you to go one, two, really fast. Five times, okay? Try to beat me. Ready? On your mark, get set, go. Good, nice. That was difficult. It's okay, try your best. If you're a little dizzy, okay, here's what I recommend. Look at something that's not moving and stare at it for a bit until your, until your Disney go, dizziness goes away, okay? You guys did a really good job today. Face here, try to get. Can you? Awesome. All right, I'll see you guys in the cool down. Awesome job, you guys. All right, let's finish up the class today with the cool down. I want everyone to go ahead, go down on one knee like this. We're gonna stretch out our hip, okay? So I'm gonna take your hand on your hip like this. I want you guys to go ahead and push yourself forward. Okay, now we're gonna count to 10 in Korean for pizza. Keep a nice nod after me. I'm gonna say, hana, doer, tet, net, hasset, yasset, irvo, either, a hope. You're awesome. All right, now this time we're gonna take one foot, we're gonna pick up our knee just like this, and then we're gonna put our hands on the ground. Just keep ourselves stable, stretching out our quad muscle right here. I'm gonna say hana, doer, set, net, hasset, yasset, ilgo, yder, oho. Yeah, awesome job, you guys. All right, now this time we're gonna stretch out this leg. Okay, I'm stretching out our hamstring, reaching for your toes. Dub it together, I'm gonna say hana, doer, set, net, hasset, yasset, ilgo, yder, oho. Yeah, good job, you guys. Awesome. Let's turn to the other side this time. Ready? Now we're going to stretch our hip on this side. Good. Now make sure you don't forget to breathe, okay? Ready? And let's say Hana, Dur, Set, Net, Hasset, Yasset, Yirgo, Yider, Aho. Yeah, good. Nice. Now we're going to take this foot. We're going to stretch it up just like this. Good. Awesome. All right. And let's together say Hana, Dur, Set, net, hasset, yasset, ilgo, yder, aho, yer, awesome. All right, now keeping this leg straight, those pointing up, stretching out our hamstring. Ready? Good, I'm leaning down, reaching for your toes. I'm gonna say hana, dur, set, net, hasset, yasset, ilgo, yder, aho, yeah, and up. Good job, you guys. Awesome. All right, now this time we're going to go down to our stomach just like this, and we're going to stretch out. Just stretch your upper body just like this. Okay? And we'll say, Hana, Dur, Set, Net, Hase, Yase, Yirgo, Yider, Aho. Yeah, good job, you guys. Awesome. All right, now this time, here's what we want to do, okay? We're going to be on our knees like this. We're going to stretch it on our wrists. I well, guess take your hands just like this, turn them upside down, place them on the mat gently on the ground, and then very slowly lean back. Don't go too quick. So really slowly lean back. Okay? So let's say hana, dur, set, net, kasset, yasset, irgo, yder, aho. Yeah, awesome. Now we're gonna take our fingers. We're gonna go this way now. Fingers down. Good, now leaning back slowly. I'm gonna say, Hana, Dur, Set, Net, Asse, Yasse, Yirgo, Yider, Topo. You're awesome. All right, shake your hands, shake it out just like this. I'm gonna take one hand, put it on the side of your head like this. We're gonna stretch out the side of our neck here. Repeat nice lot after, be really gentle. Pull, then let's say, Hana, Dur, Set, Net, Asse. Yasin, Yirgo, Yider, Oho. Yeah, good job on your side now. Stretching out your neck. Now say Hana, Dur, Set, Net, Asin, Yasin, Yirgo, Yider, Oho. Yeah, good, awesome. Now this time, hands in the back for that here. Stretching your neck down. And say Hana, 
Yur, Zed, Nan, Kasser, Yasser, Igor, Hider, Aho, Yer, awesome. Good job. Relax your neck, relax your toes a little bit. Very good job, you guys. Awesome. All right, now we got a couple more stretches, some standing ones. Don't take your feet together just like this. I don't want you guys just to hang. Just hang down like this. No counting. Hold this position. Good. Five more seconds. And slowly come up. Awesome. Great job, you guys. Ready yet? And yeah. Hi everybody, my name is Master Taylor Kelly. I'm the creator of Dojo Go, and today I'd like to introduce to you Dojo Go Comics, a complete series of martial arts inspired comic books and a future animated series for children. Our stories will focus on life lessons derived from martial arts that will teach the kids the values of hard work, discipline, overcoming obstacles, and being a force of good in this world through acts of virtue. The first issue of the Dojo Go comic universe, laying the groundwork for all future projects, will be called Dojo Go, The Book of Perseverance, Chapter 1. This story is about the origins of Dojo, where he comes from, and why the legendary Monkey King has chosen him to be next in line to get the Cosmic Belt. A mysterious belt that changes color based on the strength of the user's integrity, courtesy, self-control, and indomitable spirit. Now, Dojo is by no means the chosen one. In fact, someone else may argue it's not his birthright to get the belt. However, Dojo, someone who lacks talent, must learn and struggle in order to become the hero the world needs him to be. Dojo will learn from a variety of teachers and masters not only the skills to defend himself and others, but will also learn to grow in virtue and unlock the true potential of the cosmic belt by unlocking all five tenets of Taekwondo. To ensure your kids will be following an entertaining but also morally acceptable story, we follow a three simple code of ethics that ensure your kids are will be reading acceptable material. Number one, no political agendas. So many shows and so many books these days have been pushing out political agendas and wokeness over giving kids a good entertaining story that not only will teach them the morality of good values, but also inspire them to become the best version of themselves. None of our stories will have any political agendas in it. There's not gonna be any wokeness, so don't worry, that's not gonna be in our stories. Number two, the ends won't justify the means. Unlike what society may be showing to kids, none of our stories will adhere to the concept of consequentialism. This is the belief that the morality of an action is based solely on its consequences. This is no different than someone robbing a rich person and giving it to a poor person. The action is still wrong. So none of our stories will adhere to this concept. And number three, morality will be presented with Judeo-Christian principles. All of our stories will take place in a world where God exists. Not pagan or mythological gods, but the God of Abraham. Many stories today either try to exclude God completely or try to replace him with mythological gods or Eastern religions, or even worse, the demonic, but not our stories. Characters will acknowledge the existence of him and the comic universe will be presented in a way where Christian Judeo principles are the foundation for society. Along the way, there will be some characters that have a hard time coming to terms with the supernatural. Our stories will present a realistic view of what it's like to be a person of faith in a secular world. The first series of comics will be a 10 part series covering the tenet of perseverance. Perseverance is one of the five tenets of Taekwondo, and one could argue that it stems from the cardinal virtue of fortitude. Fortitude is the moral virtue that ensures firmness in difficulty and constancy in the pursuit of something good. It strengthens the resolve to resist temptations and overcome obstacles in the moral life. The virtue of fortitude enables one to conquer fear, even the fear of death, to face trials and persecutions. This is a great lesson for kids to learn in a world today where fear is rampant in society. It is our hope that this series covering the tenet of perseverance will inspire kids to stand up for what's right and to not give up when things are difficult. As a supporter of our Kickstarter, you will not only get a signed exclusive cover of our comic book, but you'll also get a personal message from me as well as the author. Help us reach our goal to support a family-friendly, Christian morality-based, martial arts-inspired comic books for children.